Welcome back to the channel, everybody. This is the realistic FC24 player career mode. I'm pretty sure this is episode six. Maybe it's the seventh one, but let's jump right into it and let's see who our first match will be against. It's going to be a middle of the table matchup, Monster. I'll see everybody out there on the pitch when it's time to kick that ball around. All right, everybody, first things first, we're gonna start out with a little bit of training, nothing too major. I wanna give a quick shout out to Braze HD for giving us a new idea on how to do the training. So pretty much what we'll be doing here from now on, each match is worth at least one training. Now, if I get a goal, like right here, beautiful. Let's say I get a goal in a game, that's worth one extra training. An assist is worth one as well, and man of the match is worth two. So let's say in the next match, I put up one goal, one assist, and get man of the match. That would allow us to do five training drills before the next match that we play in. So this is my one training drill, pretty much done. I'm gonna try it again though and see if I can get a better grade, but I'll be right back when that time comes. Here we go, got the B grade on the day. I'm not sure if I'll get 9,000 points and I really don't wanna just waste my time. So with that being done, the one training drill from the last match in the books, I'll see everybody on the pitch when it's time to kick that ball around. Well, I will predict this outcome today. I'm pretty sure it's going to be a victory. They are ranked number 11 in the league, so I'm pretty confident about our chances of getting a victory. A nasty day for sure. Feels like I'm playing in the Premier League in London. You know what I'm saying? Spurs versus Arsenal. A great derby. Just reminds me of that. Looking for a cross, though. Jesus Fabianski beautifully played in. Not bad. Not a bad look to get it started. And there it is off the head. Right back to Jesus. Looking for the shot. Maybe. But no luck. Making it move. On the run, Stikes, good push. Looking for something to happen now, a beautiful back heel. A beautiful pass inside, and of course, beat on the near post once again. It's something that you see too often on FC Freiburg 2. Our goalkeepers somehow, some way, just cannot play the right path. That ball comes into the near post, let's see it again. Good back heel, slows it down, passes inside the 23, and slots it right past the goalkeeper for a quick goal in this match. You know, I want to bring victories and great performances to the channel and make sure it's an entertaining episode all the way around, but sometimes being on a losing streak and being on a garbage team is just as entertaining as being on a undefeated team it's a bit more enjoyable at least now we can look back see where we have to grow see where we came from being on such a horrible team to start our career out hopefully building up this squad into a team that can take over europe on fc freiburg the first division we'll find out and here it is a good move now hal ball roll ball roll getting crafty i like to see it from the opposition making it difficult, but he made it pretty easy right there. Ran straight out of bounds. A turnover, FC Freiburg 2's ball. All right, the second half is upon us, and it is that time to turn it up. Down 1-0. Anybody's match here for sure. If we get a win here today, I think it could spell disaster for this middle of the table squad. Now, Freiburg 2 is probably just a team that allows some young players to build up their skills and showcase their talents. It's probably not the team that's gonna push for the top of the table get promoted and be a great time all around. Maybe a handball, of course. Handball call, no surprise. Jesus, beautiful ball. Good through ball at the 24. Wutz, looking for the pass now. What a pass, 26 finish. Oh, what a goal. Will call finishes through to the back of the net. 1-1 one, one even Steven, 62 minutes played in this one. Wow, it's the matches that you do not expect the big time goals to come in. A beautiful pass, come on. You cannot get better than that. It's the pass that sets the shot up and the shot that finishes the playoff. Beautifully hit to the near post and it seems that everybody in the Bundesliga 3 cannot play the near post. So I'll be looking there on my next shot. What a boot to the left side of the pitch. Dinked around uh, Lee Jin Han. Good touch in the midfield. Let's space out, Stark. Flips it outside, I'm looking for Lee Jen Han on a drive. Here it is, Lee Jen Han, maybe. One more, one more. I try to get that finish, Schneck. It's that right foot of Jesus Fabianski, it's dreadful. I have a one star weak foot. I made it as hard as possible to be pretty good on this game, so. What a slide tackle, Jesus gets the ball off the boot. Looking to make a play and he's staying in the press. Knows what he has to do, Lee Jen Han. Beautiful touch, Jesus in the run. One more ball, has to be. Second goal for Wurtz, finish, goal! Finally, baby, a finish and a win. All praise to the most high in this one. Had to be. The FIFA gods looking out for us, and we go out here and snatch a victory from the grips of the opposition. Wurtz, 
goes through and gets the brace on the day. Jesus Fabianski, two assists, man. That through ball was so picture perfect, KDB level. He's starting to reach that pinnacle, at least in the Bundesliga three, where he has to showcase these talents on a different team. And that's game, baby. Just what you want to see from the first match in this episode. A great victory, and I'll see everybody in the next one. All right, it's pretty funny. That was the perfect time to bring it back to the training. I was talking about it earlier. One goal is a training drill. So let's say I had one assist and two assists. I also had man of the match, which is worth two training drills as well, which is now equals to four. And just so we are all clear, we always are going to have at least one training because one training for one match, which makes our fifth training. So that man of the match performance with two assists and that one game allows us to get five training if it's confusing for anybody uh, let me know down below and once again I'm pretty sure it's Braze HD shout out Braze HD for this idea in the comment section if you want to get shout out in the video comment something down below and I'm sure I'll put it in the video all right everybody I'll see everyone in the next match on the pitch with a victory hopefully we'll see <laughs> Mm -hmm. Let's do it. I'm ready. I'm excited and determined to go out here and get this victory today. The most assists in the competition. You know who they're talking about. It's Jesus Fabianski. I'm pretty sure he's sitting at nine on the year. So today we'd like to come out here and get 10 assists for the season. I'm feeling good about it. And let's keep moving that ball. This team we're facing today, Svan Husen, is going to be ranked number 18 while we are ranked number 19. I'm pretty sure there are four points ahead of us, so a victory today would not change up the look of the table, but it definitely would change up the overall standings. Having to stay on it now, good touch. Beautiful, well played now, up the pitch. Making a run in behind, hopefully. Good touch, good turn. Good pass, one more. Good ball roll, stepping in. Looking for the cross. Oh, and almost coming in and making a great play. Jesus Fabianski has been stepping it up tremendously right now for his team. He could become player of the month. And I feel like player of the month might be worth five training drills in its own. Let me know what y'all think about that. Is that too much? Maybe it should be three, maybe. Let's do three. Player of the month will be three training. Whenever that comes around, I'm pretty sure it will. He'll have three training ready to go. Oh, that's a red. That's a red. Oh, yellow. Oh, my goodness. Thank you. The referee on my good side today. That definitely could have been a red, but hey, I don't know. I'll take the yellow card and live to play another game. Good jump, ball in. Ball away, ball away. There we go, Futs. Jesus Fabianski, make your run. Make your run, young man. Make your run, young man. Here we go. All the way, all the way. Ah, I can't make it, I can't make it. Good pass inside. Futs, one more. Futs. Thank the Lord. Almost a goal, but no luck. Good touch, Jesus, on the ball now, making his run, 26 on the hill still. Good ball roll, pass number two, and a good step. Look at Jesus, moving like Messi. Good pass. Lee Zhen Han could not get it done, but Jesus Fabianski, Yilmaz, moves it inside. Jesus, good pass. Lee Zhen Han tries to move it backwards, and he just can't. All right, nothing to say about that match. It ends up being nil-nil to end this one off. Another draw. It turns out that's our 18th draw on the season. We're trying to look for a record now of the most draws in a season. I'll see everybody in the next one, hopefully with the victory and hopefully getting on the board. Another match, another moment for Jesus Fabianski. I really have no expectations ending off this season. We're not gonna win anything. We're not playing for any trophies. So we might as well just keep moving forward and keep playing our game. Play the best we can, get the most assists that we can and send the most crosses in that we can. I'm also gonna showcase exactly what teams are interested in us, what contracts we can get, and maybe we'll go to a different team because FC Freiburg, I'm not gonna be able to get that contract, it looks. I haven't been able to get enough crosses in, so let's just keep moving. Anybody? What a save by the keeper. I should've went for the goal. I think I should've went for the goal there. I mean, you gotta keep moving forward. I'm doing that pretty well. Let's look for the cross now. Ball in, Li Han. A horrible take, no luck on that shot. And he moves it outside now. A good touch by Jesus, just enough to get the ball off the boot. Yo, Mass into Rudlin, woke off. Looking for the touch, Li Han. Got you, twin. Make a run, make a run. I have no idea who was right next to me on the right-hand side, but I was waiting for him to run through the hole there and go to the goal. Next time, I'll just do it because he seems like he doesn't want to score. Good pass in, and of course, quick goal on us, no surprise. I'm not gonna watch that one again, it was pretty simple. Nobody's pressed up on him. Look at that touch. 
He was able to catch it on his chest. Pause. At the post, man. That's crazy. But of course, a defeat once again in the books. I'm pretty sure that's like our 10th loss on the season. I think we have three wins, 18 draws. So that pretty much showcases exactly where we are. While I got the recording going, I'm going to jump over here to Dynamo Dresden, number one, and look at the top of the table. They are fighting for it. Definitely glad to not be there and be in the crosshairs, but still a bit disappointed to say that our record is 3, 18, and 10. 19 goals in 31 matches. Possibly the worst performance we've seen by any attacking team. Like, look at the rest of the league. At least 30 goals. We haven't even cracked 20. So hopefully in our next match, we'll get that 20th goal for the team. I'll see everybody when it's time for that match. They wouldn't have the big-time games if it wasn't for the big-time players. Jesus Fabianski coming out here and looking for his 10th assist. I'm hunting. I'm still searching, and hopefully in this match, we'll get what we deserve. Double digits assists, exactly what we need, and exactly what we cannot miss. Now, I'm not really sure what we need to do to get this assist because our teammates have been playing to a level that we do not want to be around for too long. A good touch though by the defensive play, Rudlin in the midfield and he's on it still. Now this is what I want to see. Look at that. Lugvitz. No cuts just yet. Looking for the assist. Making a move. Mourinho. Good touch. Let's see what we can work with. Ah, good pass inside. One more. Fautner. Tiki Taka. You know the deal. Beautiful. Travella. Oh no luck. I like it though. Starting off strong. And we're getting ready for this fourth match. Here we go. Lungwitz on the move now, and I'd love to see it. Let's see the touch, though. Will he go inside? Bar? I don't know how good his passing is. Slots it off. One more. Oh, what a play by Manu. He jumped right down. He kind of played me like Conte. That's exactly how he came down on the ball. We're going to have a outswinging cross coming in now. Decent power. Good height. Not good enough accuracy, though. I'll get a little bit better. He's probably going to go outside here. Ball over the top. We got to play it. Wow. Well, pff, he made that pass like nothing. Sapina in the Vonick. Oh, man. It's laughable. It's just funny to me. It doesn't really matter how we play at this point. We know the team is garbage. Um, so I'm not really surprised when they go down there and score on us. I'm pretty sure our goal differential was maybe like minus 20 at this point. Probably like 40, 35 goals scored on us. And we know we've only scored 19 goals on the season. So if Jesus Fabianski can get a 10th assist, it will also be the 20th goal for the team. Fauna, good ball. Good cross, but not good enough. Good touch, good touch. Look at Jesus. Foul, ref. Look at the tenacity staying on it. Good pass into the midfield. Right back, right back. Good strength. Rudlin. Horrible pass. What's going on? <laughs> Rudlin, every time, it seems like he wants to nutmeg somebody on the pass, but he doesn't have skills for that at all. So I'm not sure really what's going through on his mind. I didn't call for that ball, but hopefully he picks it up in the second half and allows us to win. Here's Vonick. Already one goal in this match, but of course, a good defensive play from SC Freiburg too. Well played. Off the boot, I like it. Messi, 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 immense Messi, Ankara Messi, oh Messi, like look at that control, and the ball over the top, finish, finish, finish the play, man. Come on. Right now we are in a different world. It's beyond me. I'm holding the ball close to the chest like a newborn baby right now. Was not expecting that. They jumped that line up at me and caught it off my boot. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh no! Of course, man. Definitely game over and I really have no words to say. I'm pretty sure this episode has one more match left in it. So I'll see everyone in our fifth and final match. Hopefully we get a victory. Hopefully I get on the board. See everybody when it's time. I guess after that last match, Jesus Fabianski was talking some, uh, some game that the gaffer didn't like and he sat him on the bench. So here he comes in the 55th minute against a top team in the table. We have not cracked 20 points. This team has 50 points. They're double R's, so pretty much our backs are on the wall, and we'll see how the tables turn tonight. Maybe we'll get the victory. I am gonna come out here and look for the 10 rating, no surprise, and that should be a fact. I'm very excited. I don't really know what to expect going against these top teams, but every time we face off against them, I feel something come out of Jesus Fabianski. It's like his will to win shoots through the roof 
And now he wants to showcase everything he's about. Ball away. Get the ball away. Let's go, Salta. Okay, we already got an injury on the pitch. What? Not what you want to see coming on. Starting off early. And let's see what Lang has. Good touch. Look at him. Already pressing me up. Come on, Lang. Ah, Lang, bro. Whew. Got me looking crazy. Lugwitz. Beautiful. But Step up and move by Jesus. Good touch. No way. We still own it. Oh, wow. This dude's fast. Man, we playing against Kyle Walker. Look at Jesus. Play it. Play it. KDB, KDB, Kevin De Bruyne, Kevin De Bruyne, who knows the man, Jesus Fabianski, nobody, he went from Italy to Germany and forgot everybody, back at the crib, we see net pass, he was controlling the ball like he had plates on his back, a beautiful through ball, slots it past five defenders, and what a finish man, look at Mourinho, we haven't seen him shoot nothing all season, and the first time he pulls out a Mbappe like shot, you ever seen that, um, he like shot one of the Champions League, he dribbled in with the right foot, let it fly and curled around the keeper, just like that, Luca Marino, he might be Italian as well, hey that was an Italian link up right there, what a save by Salter, wants to keep this game as a win in the books and we need it right now, our fourth victory, that would be amazing, breaking 20 points on the season before the last month of football, would be huge. Let's see though. Good run, good run, good run, good run. Look at the moves, look at the moves. Nothing crazy, just the technique, keeping it close to the vest. Ball roll, lose the man. All right, let's dish it away, let's dish it away. We have to know when it's too much dribbling and when it's the right time to keep dribbling. Good touch, come on, Bar. Make the run, make the run. Close. I thought it was gonna be a bit more inside towards the keeper, but I mean, it wasn't a bad pass. Seitz has his sight set on the net, making a drive up the left side of the pitch, and maybe a pass on a cutback. Here he goes, number seven, making it look good. Seven v seven here. Jacob in the move. About a quarter of an hour now left to play. 15 minutes on the clock. We'll see exactly who wants it. Does this top team have the desire to win? They are top of the table, I'm pretty sure. Number three, very close. It's a tough race in the top and a beautiful pass, but just played by Pepic. Jesus on the day makes the play and of course we are out. Lang, good touch now, beautiful. Good pass. Look at what? Rutland in the midfield. Can he make this pass? We'll find out. Beautifully played. Jesus on the run. I'm sliding. Oof. And we're making it count for sure. Home advantage. Five minutes left to play. Back on the wall right now for the opposition. Will we win this match? If we do, I'll be extremely excited about it. Two wins in one episode. We haven't seen that in quite some time. Sights trying to look for the cross now. Cuts it back on a good ball roll. 2v1, 2v1. Jesus playing the man now. Staying on him. There it is. Good defense. Just what I wanted to see. Jesus knows what that meant for the squad. And if we can get this ball away, we probably want it. Good play, Salter. In the net. It's a very difficult task to have, especially with this team backing you. And we'll see. Ball in 15 again. We've seen shots like that go in multiple times against us. And I'm glad today it was not that case. Going to play it back. But a handball more. Just what I wanted to see. And we're probably going to control this one. Only about one minute left. So Bar looking for a good pass now. And Jesus with a good touch. But wow, Jacob comes right up. And a handball more. Handball. No call. Okay. It's because they top of the table. They say, you know what? FC Freiburg 2, who cares if y'all don't get this win? Well, I do. Jakob on the cross. And of course, oh, Sauter, good hands. It's about time. Sauter comes up, makes a great play. Just what you want to see from your goalkeeper on the day. We get a victory, another one in this match. I'm pretty sure Jesus Fabianski, one assist and man of the match. So next time, before we start out, we'll do four training drills to start the next episode off. All right, everybody, just want to say thank you for tuning in. I greatly appreciate it. If you enjoyed, drop a like down below and subscribe for more episodes like this. I'll see all y'all back at the main menu. All right, everybody, another great episode in the books. And I really do appreciate everybody tuning in to this one. I'm going to do a little bit of a, I guess, recap so far. Sitting at 19th place, we might as well be dead last. Tied with Borussia Dortmund 2. 30 points. And look at that, goals for finally at 20. Feels good and it feels great. I do wanna make sure to show this before we take off. 
into the next episode. So it looks like our FC Freiburg contract, we're pretty much not going to get this. I don't think we will. We're going to look through at our contracts that we will be able to go to. We can go to Middlesbrough, Rio Ave FC, FC Hansa Rostock, VFL Bochum, and Argentina Juniors. These are some of the teams that I think we can be able to go to. So let me know down below if you have any ideas on where we should go or should we just tough it out see if we can make the fc freiburg first team just want to say thank you once again for tuning in as i jump over here to get the squad update here we go jesus fabianski closing in on the end of the season the italian youngster 18 years young no facial hair and barely any hair on the nuts 10 assists five goals in 31 matches nine clean sheets not a tough task but it is a job that he has done pretty well. All right, just want to say it's been Frank on the pitch with Jesus Fabianski. Peace out, everybody, and stay safe, y'all.